This old video footage from 1926 shows Wilford power shovels with Fortson power digging a hole. The Fordson tractor hit the market in 1917, and its immense popularity led to the creation of a diverse industry of aftermarket parts with which the farm tractor could be modified to meet practically any whim or application. Established engineers and backyard welders alike came forward to offer features and attachments that made the bare-bones Fordson tractor the picture of versatility. They created and sold anything from rear fenders, which the first Fordsons didn't have, to heavy contraptions of angle iron, cables and gears that made the forts incapable of digging basements, grading roads, or hauling dirt. In 1925, William Ford, the younger brother of famed industrialist Henry Ford, entered the construction equipment business by founding the Wilford Shovel Company in Detroit. The company was renamed the Universal Power Shovel Company in 1927, with William Ford as president. One of the products of this enterprise was the Wilford one-quarter yard shovel, the most obvious component of which was a gray Fortson skid unit. In addition to the Fortson power plant, the shovel used several parts from Ford cars and trucks. The crowd device on the shovel was a Ford truck worm gear. The machine could be purchased at Ford dealerships. United States production of the Fortson tractor ended in 1928, the same year Universal found a new owner, Unit Corporation of America, and a new power plant, often McCormick Deering. 